guys what's good how you doing i hope you are doing well welcome to vinyl tv if you are new to this channel and if you are please consider subscribing thank you very much indeed for stopping by thank you very much indeed for clicking what we have here is hp multifunctional printer m283 fdw this printer is colorlesser what we're going to do is give you an overview of this printer then we connect this printer to wi-fi network okay so going to turn this printer around from the back here the power cable goes right here if you have any paper jam this is where to check check for any paper jams and debris right here okay the usb cable goes right this here usb cable goes in here this printer is dual band you can connect it via wi-fi network and the usb cable connection the good job is included in the packaging but also we have this advenet tech store free delivery here in uk this printer is multifunctional printer you can copy scan print and fast from this printer is for office for office use student work is built with your space in mind is using ink toner 207 ink toner this printer uses security uh, dynamic security so you turn this printer on and off this is the on and off button right here okay and uh, ink, ink toner is right here okay so it's using one four one two three four black blue red and yellow toner okay and here is the scanner you can see here is the scanner flat bell scanner beautiful stuff stick your document id card you want to scan or copy then you select the function and this is the lcd screen so switch on the, this printer from right here energy star best in class mobile printing app so you're going to connect this printer with hp smart app is what we're going to do once this is re ready at the moment is initializing okay so right now it's asking us to load paper okay now what we're going to do is basically connect this printer to wi-fi network before we load the paper tray okay and if you want to do that you can just go from this is this is back going back arrow so this is the menu from the menu you can see copy scan fax usb supplier app and settings okay now if you go back again go back to the menu you can see this is the wi-fi at the moment wi-fi direct is off network wi-fi is off e-print is off so we, we, if you select wireless click ok right now we need to look for to connect this right now i can see we need to look for wireless from the start to showing us is off okay so we need to scroll down and look for the wireless network for this printer click ok right now what we need to do is we need to look for this printer on the app okay so if you get your mobile device is what we need to do right now i'm going to get a mobile device right now for us to try to connect this printer to wi-fi network and for us to do that if you get your mobile device please then when you get your mobile device i need you to go to play store okay from the play store this is google play store type hp smart app hp smart app okay this is hp smart app now this is already so i'm just waiting for this to be ready and uh, before we do that i also want us to switch off mobile data sometimes it affects with the connection so what we're going to do right now is switching off the mobile data
okay so we go back to the app to, to go to the play store download it if it's your first time you can see on my phone it's already downloaded on my phone so what we need to do but it's asking us right now to update so we just need to update it right now it's updating so you need to make sure you update it so once you download it it, it won't take a long time right now it's initializing I'm just waiting for this to initialize then we we'll go ahead and look for this printer on the network here we go right now click it open it's ready click it open once you click it open right now here is HP smart app so it's connecting to HP service Okay, so what we need to do right now, we need to look for this printer. You can see from the app, you can see a bell here, plus sign. Click on the plus sign. Once you click on the plus sign, then you choose the type of printer to add. Okay, set up a new printer. Click set up a new printer. Now it's asking us Wi Fi or Ethan cable. So click on the Wi Fi, click continue. And once you've done that, then the next thing you need to do is just go scroll down and click continue okay right now it will start to search for this printer you can see add a printer m283 lesser jet is ready so this printer right now is found on the app okay what we need to do is click on it and once you click on it so the next thing we need to do is to put the put the details wi-fi details okay for for us to connect this printer and i have the wi-fi details here a lot of people do ask me where do you get the wi-fi details you get this from your network provider so also sometimes if it's a printer you can actually co co connect this printer automatic then for you to go inside and print out the wi-fi details right now i'm going to put out the put the details for us to connect this printer okay and uh, we'll go from there And when you put the details, make sure you cross check it so that the information you put, you are absolutely clear that is correct. Okay, there's an I sign here on the app. You can just press the I sign and double, double check it. And if you have, I'm happy with it. So right now, the next thing, you need to, next thing to do is for you to click continue on the app now the next thing is click continue once you click continue it will start finding the printer okay right now it's connecting to the printer printer is found okay now it's telling us the printer is found the next thing is preparing the printer so it's accessing the network now it's asking us wi-fi has no internet click on it's telling wi-fi has no internet access click on connect Sometimes if you are struggling, you can go also go back and make sure the Wi-Fi is there. Make sure it's connected to, back to the network. I'm going to go back to the network. Yeah, we just will go back to the network and check the Wi-Fi network that my phone is connected to the Wi-Fi network. Is what I'm doing right now. Okay, make sure so right now it's click connect. Okay, right now it's connected. Okay, so we we'll go back to the app. Okay. So go back to the HP Smart app, click on the app. 
Okay, you can see right now it's connected. So right now we need to look for this print again. Okay, so click add, start new printer, click on the wifi, click continue, scroll down, click continue. Here we go. This the click on the printer. Okay, I'm going to put the details again. Okay. So initially there was no Wi-Fi on my phone. So you need to make sure your phone is connected to Wi-Fi network. Like I said, just double check that information you put is correct, which I'm doing right now. And if you're happy with it, click continue. Okay, click continue. Right now, it will start. Printer is found. Okay, right now, preparing the printer, assessing the network. Click continue. Printer prepared, IP address, here we go. Printer connected to Wi-Fi network. Printer connected to Wi-Fi network, okay? And right now, what we can do is for you to see, see printer connected to Wi-Fi network, click continue, okay? Right now, it's processing. It's checking the printer status. Connect printing service, click continue. Now, print update. You can select automatic auto update, click applied. Setup complete, less print, HP colorless subject MFP 283DW. So this printer right now is connected to Wi Fi network. Okay, so this is how to connect this printer. And if you want to print out any document now, anything you want to print, you can see right now this printer is connected to Wi Fi network. You can see on my phone, setup complete, let's print. So at the moment, what we need to do is to load the paper tray and print out alignment page, is what we need to do. So it's asking us from the screen here, load paper hp recommend color lesser paper for the best printing results so what we're going to do right now is to load the paper okay and complete the alignment head this is how to connect this printer to wi-fi network if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe thank you and stay blessed